Hello, welcome back to Thrice Newsroom. I'm your host, All Things Wrestling, and today we're going to be looking at all the wrestling news from Saturday. We start with a very interesting story. According to Brian Alvarez of the Wrestling Observer, Finn Balor and AJ Styles are ex- expected to be given a lot of time for their match at TLC. As you should know by now, but if you don't, Bray Wyatt is being replaced by AJ Styles due to illness. Which is good, they need a lot of time because it's going to be one hell of a match, and I'm so excited. Uh, and also, with Roman Reigns uh, being out of action due to illness, um, he also noted, Brian also noted, that WWE is working on major creative changes for Monday night. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. Can't wait to see what they're going to do. Uh, and Daniel Bryan reacted to Kurt Angle returning to the ring with the following tweet. Interesting. That that little emoji like that. The thinking one. Hmm, interesting, Brian. Do it, do it, Brian. Oh, uh, and then we go to Pete Williams on what made him decide to return to Impact Wrestling. Scott Demore just asked me to do it, kind of. That's a short story of it. Uh, I'm not even going to ring the lo- read the long story because Jesus is long. But yeah, he asked him to come back. So yeah, fair enough. Pete Williams has got the best finisher of all time, the Canadian Destroyer. Fight me on that one, seriously. Best finisher ever. The Canadian Destroyer. Ooh, and then we go to a really, really cool story I want to mention. There's uh, a new vi- new movie made about Rowdy Roddy Piper. Um, the like description. On July 31st, 2015, the world lost one of the most recognisable and successful wrestling personalities of all time, Rowdy Roddy Piper. A new film production is now available to stream from Nine Legends director David Sinoit uh, to feature never-before-seen footage of the hot rod titled Rowdy Roddy in his own words. Dig deep inside the 40-year career which was spotlighted in WWE and WCW as well as the big screen, including the lead role in John Carpenter's cult classic, They Live. I've watched the actual trailer for it. It looks really, really good. Uh, it's be available to be streamed now at NineLegendsFilm.com for seven ninety nine dollars. So, seven ninety nine dollars. I don't know how much it is for England. I have not checked it. It's got um, star stars like Bill Goldberg, Mike Tyson, Chris Jericho, Rob Van Dam, Roddy Roddy Piper himself. Uh, it's absolutely. Incredible looking. It looks like a great way to honour Roddy Roddy Piper. If you're interested in it, please go check it out. I may consider actually watching it myself, to be to be fair. It looks that good. I'm actually going to um, save that story because I want to find it. Oh, uh, and Kevin Owens was sent home early from the WWE South American tour due to what the company called personal reasons. He noted on Twitter that uh, I'm not sick, I'm not hurt, my family needed me home. Thank you to WWE and the fans of Argentina and Chile for their support and understanding. Well, whatever's going on, please take care of it, Kevin. Best of luck to whatever it is. We're all thinking of you, praying for uh, whatever it is to be resolved. So, yeah, best of luck, mate. Uh, then we go to my final story, uh, Q&A with Kurt Angle on Twitter. On Facebook, sorry. Uh, which year was his best run? WWE 2003. I was crushing it. Titles, best matches. It was a lot of fun, but I got better after WWE. I had some amazing years in TNA, but I'm glad to be back in WWE. To be fair, I have agreed with that. Me and my, me and Ben were talking earlier, saying that Kurt Angle has only got better with age. We saw him wrestle last year, and he was amazing. He's got even more bloody beast, bestial. It's an absolute beast in the ring, he really is. Um, oh, yeah, people asked him to update the situation of Neville and Nia Jax. Don't know about Neville, but Nia should be okay to go very soon. They're both important talents to the roster. Have you ever dealt with anxiety during your career and how did you keep yourself relaxed? Yes, breathe, inhale, exhale a few dozen times, clear your mind, meditation, it works. With the Shield back on Raw, how do you think this will affect the remaining roster? The Shield opens more possibilities like tag matches, survivor series around the corner. It'll be interesting to where they go from here. Oh, uh, what's your favourite finishing move from another wrestler? The sleeper, so easy to take, LOL. Any regrets you imagine? I wish I would have taken better care of myself. I abused my body without nourishing it. I had no maintenance routine. I do it. I do now. Is there one wrestler who uh, intimidated you when you walked 
into the locker room when they walked into the locker room not so much intimidated it's tough for me to get intimidated but the undertaker has amazing presence you respect him the second you meet him fair enough and that was the news not that interesting but i thought i'd actually cover it today i just kind of didn't want to leave all these stories unread even though it's not that interesting apart from the rowdy roddy riper rowdy roddy piper sorry story and the Kevin Owens is quite interesting. But yeah, that's the wrestling news. As always, if you have enjoyed it, please give this video a like. Please support me on Patreon. Link in the description below. Subscribe to catch... Subscribe to see more content. And I'll catch you later.